Today, Monday, the 24th day of August, 2020. It's a new week. A lot of things then happen over the weekend. I don't know if you don't get opportunity for make you watch the video where the Sierra Network family may ask we for do that one, one minute video and make we send them in. And yes, yesterday on Sunday, we were able for release the video. One for tell thank you to we all we don't see them. You ain't no see them it. It is YouTube and also it is on Facebook. We just they try for say make we share that video day so that at least the more views we get, now the more people them go here waiting we talk day. And uh, you go meet the right people, them. The message go meet them. We say from we part, don't do we own. We make the message go as far as society will go. We just uh, wait for, yeah, you forgot to get any response from them. So you will be, they say, you know, see Tripoli. I think that video, they don't, don't make you don't see Tripoli now. Eh? <laughs> um, the COVID-19 status update for today. 254 tests. Now in the lab they analyze. 254 tests. Out of that 254 tests day, five turn out for be positive. Five turn out for be positive. Western area urban, three. Kenema, one. Tonkolili, one. Western area, urban, three. Kenema, one. Tonkolili, one. On Saturday, we'll be there. Remember, I'll be able to pick up something where I say, I go able for discuss with Nakovac on Sunday. We I find out say uh, one or two numbers them we then give not be look correct. So yes, on Sunday as promised, I begin for engage them and explain to them, and then says I begin for confirm say yes, waiting I be notice not to, and then be promise for say then go able for follow up am. Indeed, then we do that today. The spokesperson. For Nakovac, when I Solomon Jamiru, I'm be able for confirm and apologize. Say yes, then self na flesh and blood, then can make mistake. In T triple back na flesh and blood, na make me say be blow my Saturday. Then self na flesh and blood, then can make mistake because then a human being. But however, they don't take note of that. They don't take notes of them, and then will follow up them. And go we'll follow up am and uh, then we'll come back to we for show who side the discrepancy they by the numbers them. They admit say yes, na mistake they mistake. And we we'll wait for see how the follow up go talek and waiting na the actual number will be supposed for the under. Let we come to the other numbers them. The cumulative confirmed case. Now reach now 1,997. 1,997. For the past 24 hours, nobody not lost in life to COVID-19 as alone. So we still stand at 69. The active case at the isolation center them they still there at 700, 371, 371. Cumulative recoveries don't reach 1,557. For the past 24 hours, we get seven new cases. The number of people them where they in quarantine right now are 523. The number of people them where they on discharge from quarantine 
at 10,458. 10,458. Well, we still hold that number day because that is that issue day. But Nakova Kwam for make me, you know, see that the correct number that one day. But then go come back. That's how I be make the number be go right up. For me, then can't tell we who say the mishap be day. We make that particular thing day happen. We know say then can always get a big idea for the week. And the big idea for this week, they say strong communities succeed. Strong communities succeed. Corona fits, now we all fit. The big idea for the week, from the 23rd of August to the 29th of August. They say anybody can get coronavirus. With family members, we party them, we neighbor them, we schoolmates them, and even the one them who they work with. They say it can happen to anybody. And say we all they at risk of getting the coronavirus. And so, so because of that, let we show thanks and appreciation to health workers them. The one they would not bravely stepped up for care for patients them we get COVID-19. Uh, we, this COVID-19, one year ago, we none, none know but ourselves. And also say, make we show care and kindness for the one them we get the virus. And say, the virus, they act differently by different people them. All man get away how the virus they affect them. And also, not too far now, but we go back. And so some people them it go affect them titty go. And say because of that we need for encourage that we able for manage we self day after day. And say make we show we appreciation and support to we neighbor them within a quarantine. Because we do, then they sacrifice a lot for protect the safety and health of the one they wouldn't lack and also the communities them. What do they mean by that? Because the one they grieve for make they they not quarantine self isolate so that they not go come out na do where they go can rob the virus by other people them. And say so we also can show others we care. By way we too go do, we go call them, we go check on them, and we go even carry it for them. Or other items then, we will not say then go need. If they sick or then they na quarantine. And we no say they not go able to come out. Na do. For them thing then they. That kind way they, na we will go show kindness to them people then they. And say for more information, make you go to coronafets.link, the big idea. Corona fets. Now we all fets. Corona fets are waiting. Now we all fets. So now so we go left the COVID-19 status update for today. When they come to we program proper. We program for today. Even, f okay, I go say not to now, this particular issue don't they float around. But lately, the voice become much more louder. From all angles. The voice become much more louder. But make we go through within Sierra Leone police gee as a press release. They say the security sector, the one against any 
thing we go disrupt the country in peace and stability. Then they won against anything. We go and disrupt. We go and unbog. Salon in peace and stability. They say they write this inside Freetown on the 24th of August 2020. Salon police intelligence estimates they indicate say certain individuals them. Some they say they sabi them. Some they say they no sabi them. Say they don't they engage in activities including making pronouncements that are tantamount to disrupting the peace and stability of Sierra Leone. They say the word then with them people had on the talk. They shake the peace. Eh? We salon gets. That kind of word within the talk. The security sector want for assure the general public. Say the young commitment now for protect the citizens, their well-being, and the integrity of Sierra Leone. Salon police say, they want for assure me and you, and now it's in a talk on paper, they want for assure me and you say, then commitment now for protect the citizens, and their well-being, and the integrity of Sierra Leone. Make a pause and I have us. I don't know if you see the video where the Inspector General of Police begun at OSD. I don't, we don't upload an I But if you know, say it's, I think Google can play them based on the statement where police intel when I say, then commitment and for protect the citizens and the well-being and the integrity of Sierra Leone. We can a waiting and see that video day. In the spirit of inclusion and supportive security, everyone is encouraged to remain law-abiding. Inside that spirit of inclusion, eh? and then say with all the support, we all go gi to the security sector as alone. All a man that encourage we for follow the law within a salon. And if you see any kind of suspicious activity where if you say this can go bring number and the country and say make you report them. Report them. In the view of what in the happen so, the security sector of Sierra Leone wishes to assure the general public say then they in full control and people are encouraged to go about their normal businesses without any cause for alarm. And say make we go about to make we go about with normal business. No cause to alarm. Why you want give cause for alarm? Hmm? Salon police don't say make we go about to normal business. So do I. But like I said just now, eh? I want to make we watch this video. We need for watch them. That way you don't see them yet. Maybe some people cry and they don't see it. But some man see. Not to the entire video. I just shot one no more. But this is the term of the Inspector General of Police being go. Now OSD, remember which will be dealt with the last time now. Now that it is. What they tell them, but within the 
Inspector General gets in mind and all those things. And that particular day, they, you go good make we watch them. You will be there at the rank of uh, the name of SSZ. Where? Sit to walk out of this country. We will not be rich 1,000. We sacrifice. We are part of the team. We fight with the soldiers and for make sure sovereignty, peace, come of this country. And from that ground, let people that don't see me say we are enemy. We are friend to everybody. We stand. We stand. We stand. Side of the body for less of the food, this one on the side of the body. But if you give away the bet you, where the bet you will be, no encourage you too much. <laughs> if you give away the encourage you in the sort of body, fine, encourage you. Yeah. Unless I should cry during the night, take her. Nine yeah. hours. Yeah. Yeah.
police them. We order the person in one team. Get them all on board, lock her as a team for support IG in dream for let me come through. Yeah. You don't watch the video? That's not the same way the Inspector General of Police visits their quarters if for tell Tengi. But then say no, even for we don't go talk, you say no, but he insists make the Inspector General go there. I just read for we the press release from the police headquarters. Make we come with Usman Toli. Make we are waiting on your contribution for today. Okay, uh, thank you very much, Tripoli, for having me. And also, I would like to thank the viewers and listeners and then they get a very civil conversation on the uh, page uh, like that. Um, we get very peaceful viewers and listeners then. So I will thank them for that. Uh, today, we mission Ayana for come discuss the press release we come up from the security sector where they warn the public against any disruption to the country in peace and stability. Now that press release day we can discuss today. And we all don't listen to uh, the video we you put up and uh, it's an interesting one. Uh, but before I go to some of the information, we I see another video day. I will just say I welcome the idea of the security sector force for release and advise the public on some of the audios then and some of the discussion we go around in terms of inciting and provoking the peace and stability of the country. So I really um, support the security sector uh, purely because it give we assurance, it will give the public assurance, and that uh, it will stop the panic when they go around because a lot of people then then they, they don't they panic when then they read them video, then they, they read them audio, then they, they go around for instigate people them for incite people them as if. You know, there is about to come war in our country. So for that reason, I welcome the idea for the press release. But having said that, we also they plead with them for land and land for be independent and professional in their activities. Then. In other words, in as much as we appreciate the press release for come to the public and inform we and also sensitize me. We also, therefore, plead with them for let them become very professional and independent with their functions. Then, because one of the things them where we don't categorically make clear in this forum is that the police are not independent and they are not professional in their approach. Yeah. And don't forget the OSD is part of the security sector, it's part of the place. And one of the interesting observations from that video the way we all watch, uh, I believe then the chief superintendent, uh, Francis Moses, who are the director of OSD, I think he make that quotation there. He talks uh, the responsibility they're ready for make sure say, they support the government. That is interesting. That is very important. Yeah, indeed. Now, perhaps the responsibility that for support the government, but you will also ask the question, are they only there to support the government? Is it, is it not about protecting lives and property? That, I think, now the most important quotation and the won't be one year from them. It's not about protecting the interest of the government. It's about protecting lives and property. They are there to serve the citizens of Sierra Leone, not to protect the interest of the government. I think 
that statement will have been further expanded. But a lot of people, you know, might be influenced with that quotation day. But we are not surprised. We know, say, for most of the time, whether this government or previous government, all the police they do is about protecting the interest of the government of the day, which we don't criticize to a very large extent. Now I move on to the main points. The press release came about as a result of what recently happened now, Mali, as you say, uh, triple A. We see the coup will take place now. Mali it sparked a lot of questions, that is, especially in Sierra Leone. Also, we see a lot of audios that come up from known as well as unknown individuals where they try to provoke and instigate the public, say, many people and come out and protest and that asks the present president for make a go. A good number of you don't listen to those audios. In this platform, not the name names, but categorically, I don't say a good number of you now, I don't read them video in day. Let me warn everybody, Sierra Leoneans, then, to be specific. Who's them? Nothing way they don't take a different approach these days. Yeah, force them. We're involved in a coup. Sometimes you they see the benefits of them. But in recent times, coups them, nothing way don't come out, it don't become outdated. Yeah, it don't change it don't take a different narrative. It don't change uh, uh, the way how uh, it don't evolve these days, yeah. One thing for sure we know these days, schools, they bring enormous hardship, suffering to the people and a lot of political instability in the country. So therefore, and then they whip them at the system. So the one way they call for coup, they call for protest, call for government must go, I think that is not the best way forward. Yeah? And as some of our own they follow right now what in the go on in Mali, we are not say the situation is still the unfold. Even the coup leaders then, you know, recently, I think up to yesterday or today, I don't know, uh, ECOWAS get a meeting who said they try for reverse the coup. I think that the disagreement that, while as the coup leaders, they want a transition, you know, but the ECOWAS leaders, they want for Mecklen reverse the coup so that they will give President Keita back the power, I think, and still up on that. So it's not a profitable venture now for the one that will stage the coup, thinking that it's a profitable one. And when this thing happened, and we see a lot of individuals come out of the media, they instigate people, incite people, you know, we see one popular figure when a uh, uh, silver blighting, he self release what we call Udi One. They respond to one particular individual who is very popular in the media for instigate and incite people and for do otherwise. Yeah? See, the blind respond to that. We all know the content of that O1 or Judy where he say it's not the current president for go, but um, the leader and chairman of the uh, exist, I mean, of the existing opposition and in forgo. So we'll see how the incident unfold. I think say, this brings a lot of panic in the country, subsequently leading to this press release. But one thing, Triple A, you make them quite clear, and you see, it's very important. You see, people are going to refrain from this sort of activity. I don't think a good pit. Poetic Sierra Leonean go do that thing in the Yeah? As you make a clear example, you know, Sierra Leoneans these days will have to be careful the way how we demand social media, the way how they respond to social media, not to anything as soon as it's here, you accept that information they or share. For example, you know, see what happened with our Cameroon 
Ah, video. Very, very disappointing. Very unpatriotic. You know, you see something, you know, even investing. as a journalist. That is why everybody will become a journalist now on Facebook, social media. I think, say, the work of a journalist is more to do with investigate. Yeah, you know, we just own something as soon as you share, I share. That is very unpatriotic. Yeah? You know, they do that. So, again, going back to Emerson, a lot of people that advocate for democracy in our social media without, in fact, knowing uh, the basics of journalism. So we have to be very be careful and very mindful because all until they, they instigate riot, it, it, it cause chaos in a country. So we have to be mindful of who the, who social media will the follow, who they will they listen to before ever, you know, we they accept information. Yeah? And one of the important things that we see the blinding make audio is about the use of democratic tools. Yeah? I think the use of democratic tools are there. Instead of is to get people for go do otherwise. That is not in the interest of the country. As I don't explain to them some of the ramifications, some of the implications of you know staging a lawful protest. Yeah? There are other things. Let's let's look at the example where you come up with triple A. You know, say a network, you know, make a compose a video, you know, send on. Those still are some of the democratic tools. You know, a responsible government, they listen to those things. Know the needs of what we want. A lot of it come out, you know, we know say they ask for the basic human needs, electricity, water, medical. You know, you know, you name it. Those are the pressing issues. I think, say, now one of the democratic tools that this is why people keep coming back to Sarah Network because we are democratic and we are very factual in what we really do. Another democratic tool we will use were elections. Elections. Where one government not given a chance, where government not do well. When the time for elections come, vote them out. As simple as that. And I believe, so. although I have not seen, I agree with them to some extent, say, uh, several unions, them, a lot of we get coconut aid. But I think the dynamics don't begin to change. We see what happened at the last election. A good number of the public will feel, say, the APC then will win the elections. Looking at the population, looking at the amount of resources where they may get at the time. You know, people have been facing then APC for winning the elections. But unfortunately, it didn't turn out to be. So, meaning, politics don't they take a different dimension. No feel say people are going to get coconut aid throughout in their lifetime. Things in the chain and involve. Those are the things we get for, you know, government, they never remind itself. Yeah, then get them I and get all what it takes for let them win the election. But people they realize that what will be the young for, what will be the expect them, they're not able to meet with expectations. So a good number of the people them then vote them out. So it's important that um, one interesting observation before they left one, we I think say you make quite clearly uh triple A is about Divide and rule, yeah? So many things them, Western Union, then don't they live in peace with, yeah? A lot of things them, you know, uh, in terms of intermarriages, we married to each other, one tribe married to the, to the other one, in terms of religious tolerance, in, ter- in terms of intersettlement, they see Mende, they move going at the line, they rule it peacefully, Shabro, they move going uh, you know, any sign of the country, they live peacefully, Coloma, they move, you know. So those, we don't get a problem with that. We don't get a problem with religious tolerance. We don't get a problem with so many other issues. But why is it that when it comes to politics, it's always the tool where they use for divide me? Yeah? Meaning they use. Because when you look at the composition 
of the government can move on the sea over the years. Yeah? The way how then they allocate jobs them. And it's not only about this government. Yeah? All the previous government, and most of them. Yeah? Now so we don't see. Give the best jobs to uh, the strong old. You know, give the best jobs to the tribe. Give the best jobs to the supporters. You know, on that line, therefore, you know, use politics for divide we. That is how then people are they use the politics for divide we. Because simply put, if they don't do so, the next election, they not will get the support. But I think also it's a wrong strategy. Because if I am a politician, I not will use that one day. I will try who say I don't been get a support before. I will try give them the support where they, I will win I will try to get new new uh, ground to make I get more voters then. I think that tactics, I don't know how they think, but I think that tactics is a bit problematic. Yeah. We they ask the best tools for use is people and for land for vote on policy lines. Yeah? A lot of sensitization only go on. People are evolving, evolving over time. So let politicians not take people for granted. We all know to coconut aid. We all know to coconut aid. So let an office say, you know, we all are coconut aid. And politics as soon in the last election, don't they take a different dimension? People they don't they think. People now they will analyze. Yeah? A lot of education in the camera, the system, you know, so and this it resonates as well, uh, triple A to one of the questions that we pose. I think last week, one of the topics that we you raised. When you talk, say, do you have to be a politician to help in the development process in your country? You don't have to. This is why a lot of people now they take to media thinking that, you know, the best way for get the best job in the country or for jump into top hierarchy job in a salon or for jump into politics. Yeah? It's not the, it's not the best way forward these days. Yeah? There are different ways. Remember the other day, I suggested some ways them where we would help my country not to forgo into politics. Yeah? One of the ways, just follow the civil responsibility. When time comes to vote, you know, your vote count. It makes a lot of difference. For example, the last elections, you know, the present government won by only, I think, about near about roughly around three percentage points. Yeah? Which is not that great. It's not that great, yeah. So every every vote it count, yeah. So make sure when the time comes for vote, you vote because then they will make impact, yeah. And uh, do your social responsibility, yeah. Social responsibility, then charity organization. How would you do? You know, help in one in one way or the other. You must help, yeah. Social responsibility. You invest in your country, yeah? This is why some of we, you know, and a good number of our the listing, I mean, you get your people, um, apart from investment, yeah, when then they instigate the people, yeah, they get invest, uh, excitement, yeah, you don't worry because we get with loved ones then in our country. We get with, whether you get your brother, your auntie, you must get some relatives in our country. So where peace and tranquility break down in our country, they, they affect lives, it affects investment. It affects uh, the progress of the country. This is why we don't want um, those social media advocates where they incite people and thinking that people are still get coconut aid, yeah, for listening to the crap within the certain social media. We are far from it now, yeah. So we so we set a network. We they continue for advocate for peace. There are a lot of uh, democratic tools who they use. If we do one way we get now, you know, work, no left hand for elections. And when elections come, make sure you vote and make sure you vote wisely. And that's no more again for put on the table. Thank you very much, Triple A. 
And thanks to all the listeners. Then. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, Usman Tori. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Make a come with doctor. Make we are waiting to get for we today. Yes, Doctor Isato Kake Jalo, you get a platform. Um, good evening, everyone, and I hope everybody will do well. Happy Monday and happy new week. I hope for the best for each and every one of us, and everybody try to stay safe. You know, try to protect yourself, your loved ones, them, and so we put in our salon. We wish that you know COVID nineteen come to an end. We hope see everybody adhere, and also go with the big idea for the week. We see you know lots of appreciation for we healthcare workers, them, and which we want to extend that and we want to tell the healthcare workers in our salon. Thank you, and one that already work at the quarantine center, contact tracing, and everybody we involved in this COVID-19 fight. Now, Salon One for Teluna, thank you. And also, you know, and the people in back way right now, they go through the quarantine, as they rightfully say, you know, they're they in the quarantine for try to protect the community and co- protect each person as salon, so we really wish them a speedy recovery with the hope say, you know, then come back out strong and try to advocate more for make people and listen and adhere to measures that we don't put in place. And that goes into uh, showing how you care for your country, how you want to be peaceful in your country, as they don't release a press release today, say, about, you know, for and sure say, no, not disrupt peace in the country. The country really and truly needs peace. We don't need any more violence in us alone. We don't need any more, you know, war in us alone. We don't need anything where they cause, you know, commotion in our country. We don't deal with we own. And at that, then we face right now, we just try to heal from the things that we don't deal with from the 19, from 1990 to the early 2000, all then scars and like they really try for that and they left we, you know, so that we go look at the brighter future for Sierra Leone and I know say Sierra Leone and then we love the country and we want for see the country grow but we just get for be peaceful we just get for try to work together we just get for try for love one another because if we do that we can keep the country who shall we want them we could just came for the highest as always you know we not that we want even though we're not there yet you know I really want for Big Sierra Leoneans and talk to Sierra Leoneans and not just listen and not take this very seriously, you know. And that way they, you know, we do keep the country where we want it to be. And, you know, we, if we understand, say we avoid violence, not a nation or any kind of relationship when there is um, friction, we think end up for happen. There is no growth. Right, there's no movement. Even now, your own personal life or some of you friendship them. Well, now they always they go back and forth on things. Things that they go forward, you are still there in a stagnation mode. Where they say things now they move forward, right? So, Lord, try for stay peaceful and try for communicate and dialogue in a peaceful manner. We'll do that. Definitely, we we'll see things and they go well in the country. And Lord, not forget part of the motto and our unity, freedom and justice. So, you know, unity, freedom and justice, you know, entails being peaceful and that really can help the country a lot do well. And um also, you know, uh, I want for say thank you, right? I want for really say thank you to all those people and we where we all participate by the message to the Sierra Leone government for ensure say we get the basic human needs now we country, some of the things that we all cry for. We do hope say really the government will listen to we and we pray say, you know, the next message will therefore go out, we will get more voices, more faces, so that they really understand, say, this now we will be pray for, and this what we want for the nation. And I know, say, everybody get that now their heart, even though you are not part of the video, but trust me, I know within you, just viewing the video and the comments, them, you know, that shows, say, you also took part in that video. So we want to say thank you to everybody, and law show more support the next time, and law see how this can go. You know, advocacy is the best um, medicine for the country right now. 
law advocates for peace, law advocates for justice, law advocates for human rights, and the things that we need as, as, as human beings, you know, that's not something we want for make sure they will do. And also, uh, in terms of uh, keeping the peace in the country, definitely I want to see I agree say we get for try to avoid the tribal lines in terms of how we they deal with things in the nation. You know, every Sierra Leonean counts. We need to know that. You know, matter which tribe you belong to, you know, matter which party you belong to, in order for you maintain peace. See that Mende man or see that Timini man or that Maringo man or that, you know, Fula or Susu or men, any one of the Limba, different tribes that would share in the country. See them as Sierra Leonean. Don't see them as a different tribe because at the end of the day, where they put now your passport, they need to say now the passport, you're not Maringo man or you're not Fula man, you're not Timini man or they just say you are a Sierra Leonean, right? Then we'll just put the district where you were born. If you were born like Quendu like me, then we we'll put say Quendu or Kailau district, actually, then they'll say Kailau district. So these kind of things, and that's what I have in my Sierra Leone passport. So don't see it that way. Don't know say tribe is not the reason for why we live in Sierra Leone. We live in Sierra Leone because we are all Sierra Leoneans. And then also we, um, as one totally mentioned, I want to say thank you, you know, for your analysis and also all the other panelists, them, you know, we can come after me. I want to tell everybody thank you and we host Tripoli and the, the audience and everybody else will be listening to me, you know, when somebody gets a qualification for a job, not say because it not belong to your party or it not belong to your tribe, so you really get a job. I still say that's wrong. That's a human right violation right there. If somebody is qualified, give him the job because he will do the job for ensure say we nation go forward. If we do that, we can really you no know, say salon now with all young. Not one person you. Salon. Now we all your name it and say Mama Salon. Why? Now one one born them all them different tribes they are so now the country. So we all get for love one another and embrace one another and look for the best now we nation. And now they I want for stop today. I want for see hashtag we are all Sierra Leoneans and we should avoid violence. You know, so I want for see hashtag keep Sierra Leone peaceful. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Doctor. Thank you. Make a call to his friend. Make we are waiting he get for we today. Yes, his friend, you get a platform, sir. Yeah. Hello, Triple A. Thank you very much. The line is clear. I'm not sure. I hope everybody clear me clearly. Uh, thank you very much, sir. Um, and thanks to all the previous speakers and thanks to the doctor at the house. And thanks for compiling that video. We were very interested. If I be the wait yesterday, I waited and last year I see before I go to sleep. Thank you very much for you for your tactic, for you for your talent who you you you're very articulate. Thank you very much. Um the first thing about this security in a salon, um what do you want for see I'm into regarding the press release what the police they do? Um peace, of course, that like everybody in the young forum. Even the one several defects in the young for peace, not just one mark that moment today. But just because of things don't go like here until the things are dilute before that man they stop what they do. But in the area of what they say, what we want for looking into, I feel say in any institution, one of the police institution for saying now one are they in charge of for do the job them, for protect the civilians them and try for maintain law and order. I believe say um now if they get what they call like a barometer for sure, when they look say now they tell they look for, now they tell they look for, now they tell they look for, no go say say well the country you know, it is going to diverge small, small of having a kind of um, a civil unrest who will lead to either a war or just a civil unrest in any form. But here now, I feel say the Nizali type of categorizer like a body will go towards another bigger body. But based on waiting, they don't get the intelligence. It depends on either on social media and main, some mainstream media, but I believe they are more on social media. And then you come to the aspect of social media and the effect we you don't get to be mind. And we as individuals, within this technology don't come cause inside we brain. It's useful, and it gets how we don't become toxic now. We, in fact, it don't become almost like what you see, digital wildfire. They go just like that. Information come, it just they go like that. 
So, but it left to you the individualized, incorporate your mind set for you see, in other words, your brain that brain, the way they evolve, now you go make waiting now your mind because the mind, you know, they see them now the brain will always be sitting at the mind, then I'm waiting you to gather together for the people put. But I believe, say, first of all, now intelligence they don't get in different forms, so it's up to their own method of apply of, of looking for intelligence who will make them flag this. So they're not showing sure waiting and waiting. They just say no more. They get individuals and this, individuals and this, and then some other sources them and some people they wouldn't reliable. Then they say something and we all they follow waiting. They go on. We have videos and they come out here, voice clips and they come out so. So they all they, they come from different directions. People and they get different conception of things them from a particular set of people then to another set of people then. Salon, oh well, they want let it be like yanda. The way I don't be so let be like this. But I believe, say, people they know what is not the effect of civil war in the country. Who plenty people don't undergo. But I just want to see no more in any form where the police they want for can do them. I believe, say, when they don't get this intelligence, then they will get what is not that, how for apply. How they will be for apply this wire, we will be able to meet up with what is then they able to, in other words, the methodology they will apply. How then we will apply this method? Then we're able to look into qualities the whole day. Because in, in peacekeeping and in, in any peaceful country, there are two things mainly you look for. You need first of all look for if there is simple silence of arms, arms and silence, the absence of war. They look at the other arms and say, if they are the absence of war only, they are company by particular people them back. We they require for do many things they want like mutual settlement or relationship. Then tell you they see them. Or how you they characterize them? So you go for look to them to factor if then they will they feel that they will try for let peace go there in the country or peace no day. So now you place now first of all for address if the social media, all right, they are getting the information, but how are they going to handle it? They will able to try for handle this fine, then they will try for can implement another system who will able for help where the people then will be persecuted. Because I even see today in the radio democracy, the inside where they don't link a WhatsApp. Regarding the letter, they flag about information. People already talk, even already comment. So it look like, say, they say, they go don't get their own letter, where they go don't write them, waiting, they expect them for publish, and then media. So all those kind of things go on, they take place. But it not showing that part today, but that is the other thing where the police don't do. They don't even write letters to all the social, um, uh, the, the mainstream media, them waiting and waiting, them for try to bring to the listeners and viewers. But I believe, say, if they look into these qualities of saying now, if the arms are silent, I will allow the arms to move. Or the people and where they're involved, are we getting them involved again or trying to address it? So then the peacekeeper in your portion come. Because you don't see the qualities of putting na peace. The absence of this, the absence of this. You don't get the barometer. You don't test them. You don't say this, now you know I'm making come. Well, the third part of it now, where you don't begin to pass these letters now, again, the individual's concern. You don't ever try to engage them in a neutral way. We don't know. You don't try for put light for in terms of equipment that will go there in case of this. We don't know. But it don't show we say the man the manual force a day by demonstrating the action, say who will do this for the favor of this, which is quite good because that is their own main place for do. But are they first going to the stages gradually? Because they have to find out these people and more than they pass out message, they try to engage them because it's gonna cost the United Nations. It's going to cause these other people them. Then you go ask, what is the United Nations doing? They only get the peacekeeping force where they for way first day. But then they bring strategies that actually through other areas they wouldn't see well now because road not day, now for example, they fed now because food not day. But then get us bypass again some other areas they then look say, who are the police will they come? Because there are people that we can't they recently for can't train them up. You get the, 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 the bridges more and they come there. So these are the things we United Nations they look. Let me avoid this area. Let me employ back United Nations. Who can look say we not go and spend for can bring a military force here, a United Nations peacekeeping force. Who can be a problem to the nation back and cause a lot. We want for put money. Who side we go meet? Say the first way to do this. Let we engage them. 
Let me engage the heads so that they are going to tell us what they need and what they don't need. So they're not going to use another method of a faction for who's saying that this we can voice method. If at all the first place the barometer don't prove positive, and then the area where it don't dispatch EO method for try to address the issue, and then it don't look for the qualities the way they show say this is a peaceful country or this is a peaceful country. And then it gets for try to engage the bodies. Because at the area that one the most time people like get left out with not requirements. The other requirement they need they for reduce how do they say the strengthen for the mitigators them the one that will mitigate them things they are and then we try for empower and try for see say if they then are something they want no empower if it's not empowerment or then we try enlighten them so in either way maybe the enlightenment they need some of them or na empowerment or na engagement so now for us again I try for say when the leaders in the tribe the other areas wouldn't go try back uh, most people they wouldn't try for say like wouldn't they help me from politics and I, and, and I mean as the party member. So when the when the party come out to power, I get for get a political appointment straight away or else I know will be happy. So sometimes they when they try like when they raise funds to so the parties and they raise funds, then they keep their fund there. Wherein the people they wouldn't employ, you know, secretary to general for the party because the party is separate. When the, the, the people and the can when you they come as a leader inside the party for call you members that we want. So he, he, but because of this thinking link, most times when the party is they on it only he, he organize, people then when they are not politically inclined, but they then are the party for support, but they all reward most of the time, they are bringing them along to come and be in the parliament. Then the party gets in your section now. Then you get the party people where they go. So in the left people and I will get for come now. Oh, we don't know the people and problem. Then we we'll focus now on the party issue in the parliament. Then we we'll forget about the people and problem. But how this will happen? Are they for begin to save money? Wouldn't they save money? So then why are with now money we add for the small? If now one five on the one million, we we'll add for them pay. Then we give them other things. And as the party they grow, because the place fine, you shall go rip off them. That is clearly, but not try to reap and before you don't even get all the reward yet. So those are the areas of market. This is some of the areas we can lack. What then would they think about as some of the things that are good? Because you even see how parties and they say this, that this person for this, this, and this party for this. But the idea is about peace. Because at their peace can begin, but people that won't know the people and problem for address them. Just like you pick in the house, where you see left and where you come, where you go, what did they happen? You are all down 16 and 12, they begin to come up. You didn't die not daily, but you like die for daily, die for check the time. Don't let you fall. We are not in a house, they fall, they know we don't go even gather them. So then we will go inside you, but some parts you don't after them. So now I mean you take no more for tonight. And I believe say that we're able to look into this. We are God going for help, let them we will put that thing in place. Because war is not something we will solve. Now war or something or any instability in any form, it will cost money. Bullets, they're very expensive for one great bullet. How much more other equipment? But I believe, say, if the, po the police them try to implement that digital system, wherein again that other law with the Canada cyber law, they were able for put law we pass this message. Now, so they got WhatsApp, they did not able for pass message more than five ten now. So message they are carry one for more than one. say not more than two. It's just so they are encrypted and they chase all these things. But the left one now let them go, let them go implement them. Say, well, you don't do this. Now you they don't catch. Now this is the pay. So that law they back at the way like we try to a parliament, what then they look after. And for that, I hope say the police will take uh, the adherence, not to just for try go out for use a heavy hand for the time being. Um it's very necessary for use a heavy hand, but make it try for know the, the way thing the people their mindset they the how thing they go on. How I will avoid this. Because any stage where I go in the cost, any stage where I go in the cost, then what thing we don't put for will develop, we don't forget about them. Then we will blame anything that something don't happen. There are all the boys here, the boys don't begin and die. And from all those things, you get this alpha thing, you get that issue in Asanda. Remember all those things, those alpha political things. Let them try to find a way. We politicians are not going to be left and people in the end. Let them get people who did it, the one that wouldn't leave for Yanda, then left for Yanda. Then, other than the past message, let them try to know what in the past. You gift what you get, use them properly. Look, Emerson, that day we will play in music over and over. I think uh, just a talent. You see people and they move for go. So you own talent, you don't put them for poil, make them for let the country go before. Exactly on social media. Thank you very much. And let God continue for me to be as they go through the city. Thank you very much. Thank sir. you very much, Usfren. Thank you, sir. Yeah.
You're most welcome, sir. Yes, caller, they're live on here. You name and the call from, please. Yes, people, my name is Ezekiel. How are you? I'm good, Ezekiel. I don't know if now the radio they listen at the background maybe you can talk oh, oh, okay all right let me just yeah i'll make i just try for all time maybe yeah hello yes you yes Ezekiel. you get three minutes within your contribution sir all right um on the police press release where you went at the topic and the video uh when i take a look at the video and from the contributions where I get from people now. It's like, um, I noticed that inside the video, um, inside the, the the video, the police actually mentioned, like when we brought at the top, the support to the government of the day. Well, in real sense, I've not been see much of a problem with that because when we talk of government, we talk about the people. And if they go for be loyal to the people, then they for protect the government and the people as well. But we certainly get uh, concerned that the press release, we talk about known and unknown persons. And people, uh, this, uh, now some people we all be done the grapple with from the time we election done to this point. We don't see a lot of violence, who say life they don't lose. And all this, the bottom line, the root cause of that, everybody knows a, that incitement from certain individuals. This is totally unprecedented in the politics of Sierra Leone and in the history of Sierra Leone. And this don't make, we all see the kind of uh, 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 lawlessness and how this don't translate into uh, Peacelessness for ordinary citizens will go about their own business. But the question is, if the police then really the state say they are known persons for their insightful behaviors, we can amounts to chaos, which they then don't do towards their kind people in their society. And the other question to go for the human rights groups. I think prevention is better than kill. When they don't see all the things there and all the violence we will see, not only the effect when they talk about, the outcome then they talk about, and now we all cry out with. But what do the cause then violence then they we're not show readiness for address them. We get institutions we we get the mandate then they like the Human Rights Commission. I think in your in your opinion. This is like a total violation of the rights of the majority citizens of Australia. They want for, they for the go about their peaceful daily life. And for me to get a handful of Australians, where they are reflecting the majority citizens, then they, to me, it's a total violation of the human rights. But then, the like, you don't they not talk anything or do anything for prevent. At the end, when then negative actions will not happen and there are reactions from the law enforcement, then we all cry out with the effect. But we believe if we, if we so don't forget, forget over this situation, going forward, we have to be honest for address the root cause. And in the real sense, their body is responsible for the big talk. But if the police will really ensure that they have no presence, me, in my own opinion, it is time for me to take action because otherwise this thing will continue for the for the happen in that country and this is not good for the peace and quiet of that nation. Now my own um, uh, contribution that you play. Thank you very much, Ezekiel. Thank you, sir. You're welcome, people. Yes, call ID live on here. You name inside the call from please. Yeah, this is not Mike, I call from Philadelphia. Yes, Mike, you get three minutes, sir. I just want to say, um, you see, in a country where the economy, they go bad, 
things like this go happen because the people the expectation of what you want to say on the brink and I know they implement that one day instead of they create more chaos. Okay, this is Sierra Leone police. Sierra Leone police now hypocrite police. Okay, they're very hypocrite. Okay, if the government of the day, the young people in the inside violence, they are they are at the inside violence, but they know they come out and say that day. But they, 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 you know, Salon police they're very hypocrite. Man, when they talk the truth, they're hypocrite. The hypocrite police, they know they do their job. They know they do their job at all. That, that police, that man, they were in charge. So they, they're supposed to fire, you know. They know they do their job. Look, look at look at the statement where they where, where they go where they go say in front of in front of he he said one of the chief of police and go say the statement they in front. He always say the statement statement and they he's supposed to fire that man. They, you know. Now hypocrite police. Salon police, now hypocrite police, now they say they create the violence. Now they go do the shooting at Makeni, and they do the shooting at Pademba Road, and then they do all the killing there. They know they, they know they try to solve the problem now, the country. The country they go bad. They know that they, they know they do nothing, you know. Now hypocrite police, you know, salon police is very hypocrite, my man. We go for talk now and day. Any government will out of the day, if their own people and they do bad, they know they talk about that day, you know. The country is completely messed up right now. But now the police and they come and say they get intelligent, they get this. You know, let them left plenty here. The hypocrisy is too much of our country today. We want to be independent, we want to rule the country. You know, the government of the day need to take charge. The government of the day know they do their job. You know, they know they do their job. And they create all the excitement they are. If you then are host, you know they take care of the bikini. You know, you, and there's somebody from outside, they, 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 they tell a bikini information. Who if you say bikini will listen to? Now the person were the outside because you then are the host, you know they do your job. You know, then the government of the day need to step up and do their job. Now, now they, they, they point finger, they blame all man, they blame all man. Now you know they do his job. Now you make the people in the country, they're very disgruntled right now. They need to do their job. Everything they go up, the price, everything they go up. The economy bad, you know. But they know they see that in any country where the economy bad, they don't see how they happen, you know. Let, let them look for the point finger. Let them point the finger on themselves. Now they say they know they help the country. They know they do the right thing for the country. And then they will get for the say. And the police are very hypocrite. I'm your contribution, I know more. Thank you very much, Mike. Thank you. Yes, call ID live on here. You need me to say the call from, please. What, Nami? Yes, ma. Oh, okay. Um, the only thing, I don't have a call from New York. You get three minutes, ma. Yes. All I'm saying that um, war is not a pay. So long we don't get war. We have civil war for so long. So many lives uh, was lost. And when economy it go bankrupt, and we still they try to to people they see the effects for many they don't follow many grab. So all me go say to our government, please let there no be no war, let no be any war anymore. Let we try to fix that country there. Let we try to move on, because it not a pay. Sierra Leone it don't suffer too much. So me now that's what me go say to people. Thank you very much for giving me the platform. Thank you very much, Adama. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, Mike. Yes, call ID live on here. You name and side call from, please. I'm in Kuruma, the call from the United States. Yes, Kuruma, you get a platform, sir. Three minutes. Yeah, um, I left the police and um, the readiness. Triple A, let me go to the pattern of voting, especially for the runoff. I mean, even though some people in the area disagree, say, you know, uh, the current regime will not be winning the election. But if we rise enough, uh, let me be in opposition, then be powerless. Then look at the percentage. Meaning that particular percentage, uh, that particular population agrees, say, you know, this uh, particular regime for rule. Yes. They, they don't meet the people that didn't expect on it. But it's like, when you watch them, they almost don't go halfway. Then, where, you know, like, majority of we, the diasporans, and they can they incite people and say, you know, the, the, the current president must go. Must go, must go, must go. If he go, one of them will put, say, you know, when you want the way you don't get the money to make it go. Oma, what do you want I want only on the way you say majority of we the diaspora to them. I don't want to go with that statement, this sir. Hmm. 
Um, people, to be honest with you, I don't go salon after election. If you want any people, then then he's going to actually say, you know, team Tranga. No, now the word we say, majority of the diaspora, and because this is an issue when we get for can't talk about. When people you know, want to castigate, then they say, like, will, everything will, is... Uh -huh. Make, because people then they say, now not the aspoas, and the aspoas, and no. no that day, that, that one day, they, 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 they even they affect we, like, I call both people in. I'm sorry for that day, triple A. But if you can watch, you know, like, especially, you know, the, 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 the so-called, I mean, whoever they say, you know, let people in this, let people in that. We all know when you left Salon. Now, during the previous regime, why you left Salon, you use the back roads, you know, for go, who's why you day? Actually, share this question. I probably say, you know, waiting you go chase over and If you be the get on a Salon, I don't think you be for risky life and use the bypass for go, who's why you day? To be honest with you, we know the young for me who come around country. But the only thing, whatever home of the past, if that may be for like, even before implementing, in as much as the wrong deal is particular man demanded, say, you know, that five years. I know they wish for more, for, for make a shape salon, but maybe the one then, where talk say, you know, make a road. Maybe let me for second, a complete in time, then after which, if then we re elect them back, maybe we elect them. Maybe that then automatically or naturally, the country before divide. If another one, we will prefer that than any, 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 anything like we'll come back to that country. Can you imagine? We don't know what to do. They want to expect the other Yalinas and say, you know, okay, maybe accept that. It's just too bad. But five years, man, they can give them money. He already don't know half of them. Why would we not wait to answer? Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Koma. Thank you, sir.